now let us discuss about in construction of 4 by 16 decoder using two 3 by 8 decoders we know that 3 by 8 decoder accepts three inputs and it produces eight outputs whereas 4 by 16 decoder accepts four inputs and it produces 16 outputs so here our aim is we need to implement 4 by 16 decoder with the help of two 3 by 8 decoders okay so this is the first 3 by 8 decoder and this is the second 3 by 8 decoder 3 by 8 decoder accepts three inputs a b c and we have to pass these inputs to the second decoder also so so first input is a second input is b next third input is c so this 3 by 8 decoder also accepts three inputs such as a b and c whereas what is 4 by 16 fully adder it accept four inputs so here in addition to the abc we need to have one more input why because here we are constructing 4 by 16 decoder we require four inputs so that extra input is enable input that extra input is enable input okay here if enable in we know what is the use of enable input uh, if enable input is enabled that means if enable input is active that means if enable input is one then then only the decoder will produces the output whereas if the enable input is zero then the decoder doesn't produce any output irrespective of the input okay uh, let us see the truth table for this uh, uh, 3 by 8 decoder here abc are the inputs so normal combinations 0 0 0 0 1 0 1 0 0 1 1 one zero zero one zero one 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 zero triple one if the enable input is zero then what we are doing is we are complementing that enable input so what is the complement of e one so that one will be passed to here but here what is the enable input zero is the enable input so here this three by eight decoder produces eight outputs from y naught to y seven so for all the eight outputs enable input is zero here the enable input is zero but we are passing that input to the complement r okay so it complements zero value so complement of zero means one one so now that one will be passed here so whenever one is passed to the decoder then the decoder will become active so it produces the output okay so let us see the scenario here so here what is the enable input for this decoder zero so let us see the combination here 0 0 if the inputs are 0 0 0 then the first output line that is y naught is active if the inputs are 0 0 1 then the second output line y1 is active if the input lines are 0 1 0 then the third output line y2 is active next if the input is 0 1 1 then the fourth output line y3 is active next if the input is 1 double 0 next uh, fifth uh, next input line fifth one y4 is active next y5 is active y6 is active uh, when the input is triple one then y7 is active okay y7 is active we know about 4 by 16 decoder a 4 by 8 4 by 16 decoder accept four inputs and it produces 16 outputs if we observe here these eight put these the first eight outputs are similar to the 4 by 16 uh, decoder only what is 4 by 16 decoder if the inputs are all zeros then y naught will be selected as the output if the inputs are triple zero one then the second output line y1 is active likewise if the input is zero triple one then the eighth output line y8 is active so we got half of the 4 by 16 decoder truth table so now we need to construct remaining one so for that purpose we have to make the use of this 3 by 8 the second 3 by 8 decoder so here the second 3 by 8 decoder accept inputs from a b c only and the last input comes from enable input okay so here what is this input this input is a this input is b this input is c this input is enable input so here what is the enable input we are passing the value directly so here the enable input is one so for the next eight 
combinations what is the enable input one is the enable input okay next if the if the inputs are 0 0 0 then the first output line is active here what is the first output line y8 so here the first two decoder produces outputs from y0 to y7 whereas the second 3 by 8 decoder produces outputs from y8 to y15 so triple zero means first output line y8 is active double zero one means second output line y9 is active zero one zero means third output line y10 is active likewise if the inputs are triple one then y15 is active y15 is active so this is nothing but these with the help of these two three by eight decoders what we are doing we are constructing four by sixteen decoder so the, these four are nothing but these eight are nothing but the outputs of the truth table for the second the truth table for the four by sixteen decoder only so what is the one triple zero means ninth output line y8 is active next one double zero one means next output line y9 is active whereas if the inputs are all ones then the last output line y16 is active so here we need to focus on only one point that is enable input for the first three by eight decoder what is the enable input complement of the enable input enable input is let it be zero so zero complement means one so one means this decoder will be active so what is the input zero but we are passing this zero to the complementer so zero bar means one whereas for this uh, for the second three by eight decoder directly we are passing this three by eight decoder okay directly we are passing this enable input so this is about in this way we can construct 4 by 16 decoder with the help of 2 3 by 8 decoders